I want to show you guys how to blur a background. Okay, so we've got this uh, spotlight here. The background's fairly blurred, but let's take a look at how you can make it even more blurred. All right, so I've taken a very small piece of the video, just two seconds here, because it takes a, a while to render it. Uh, go to your effects browser, which is right here. Go to blur and select Gaussian blur. Take it up and drag it right onto the person. You see it's already figured out pretty much where she is. Let go of it, then come up to the right corner and hit analyze. Now it's going to go through and figure out where she is in the frame and sort of give you an idea of what it's looking at as it goes back and forth through the render process here or the uh, analyzing process. All right, now that it's done, come over to the, the uh, inspector. There's the magnetic mask. Here's the Gaussian blur. On Gaussian blur, you want to reverse it because you want to blur the rest of it, not her. So you come here, invert mask. All right, now that's pretty extreme. And as you play it, to a degree, I'm going to go back to the beginning and as you I was play going to pursue it, a degree. So it's quite wiped out and it's a little bit too much. I'm going to go ahead and select the video again here and come up here and I'm going to adjust the amount. Okay. So you can drop the amount of blur down and also you can adjust the feather. You see what it does to her edge of her hair there. See how it's blurring. You want to include, probably bring it out a bit so that there's a more of a, uh, a slight uh, feathering basically smooths the edges out so it's not as shocking. So now we'll go back. I was going to pursue a degree. And that's not, I'm going to go ahead and kill the audio so we can just watch it here. But that's not bad. That's all there is to it. That's how to use Gaussian Blur and the Magic Mask. Pretty cool. Works really well in Final Cut Pro 11. Go Texans and go Texan TV.